Welcome back to another episode of the Shade TV. My name is Marissa Hill, and I know it's been a, been a minute, but we are officially back with Supreme. <laughs> We're going to be going through pickups for Supreme week three. For those of you who are participated, this was a huge, huge week. As you know, it was the Burberry collab that was done with Supreme. So lots of people going after all of these pieces. They sold out quite fast. So we are going to jump into that. I did pick up a piece as well from Kith. So we'll give you a quick sneak peek and uh, jump right into it. unboxing and review if you're new to the channel welcome be sure to hit that subscribe right now give this video a thumbs up if you have any comments or questions feel free to leave those down below hit that notification box we do have a ton of heat coming out that i don't want you to miss out on also be sure to check out that join button as well as our merch store today we're going to be discussing my pickups from supreme week three if you missed out on my latest pickup which was the supreme sb dunk in the black and white colorway be sure to go back and check out that video i did take a sore l unfortunately on the denim jacket but i'm okay with that because as you will see in one of my pickups i did end up picking up a denim coat you'll see which color uh, so we'll go through my pickups. I also picked up a piece from Kith. So we'll start out with that and then we will jump into um, how I styled these. You'll get to see the looks for each of these and then we'll conclude with how these pieces are or how fast these pieces sold out online and we'll conclude with how these are doing on the resale market. For one of my pickups from Kith, this launched on International Women's Day. I'm a huge fan and have always been a huge fan of Aaliyah. So I definitely had to cop a piece from this collection. I wasn't sure which one I wanted. Um, actually, I ended up deciding on this cropped crew neck. This says baby girl with Kith on the bottom. It's actually fuzzy and I didn't know that it was going to be fuzzy. I thought it was maybe going to be embroidered. So it's nice and fuzzy in that white color scheme. Uh, but one of my favorite parts of this is the back actually. And it's because this is a really just dope photograph of Aaliyah. I'm obsessed with it. It's nice and black and white. And I think it just pops quite nicely off the back of here. But I love that Kit decided to celebrate with such an icon like Aaliyah. I grew up listening to her music and seeing her in movies. Romeo Must Die, one of my favorites. Uh, but I definitely am so happy that I was able to get this. This is in a size small for size reference as well. And congrats to anybody else who picked up any pieces from the Kith collab done with the Aaliyah photographs and text. All right, now let's jump right into it. So why don't we actually start out with the deck? I was able to cop the deck in the beige colorway. This is the signature Burberry color scheme. So I definitely wanted to get the signature colorway for this collaboration. I think this is just such a fire deck. I love how the Supreme just really pops off of that Burberry pattern in the back. Uh, and I think that the white just really complements it quite nicely. Oh yes, and this retailed at $68 for those of you wondering. All right, next up, let's go to the BOGO tee. So I was able to get this in the white colorway. Again, obsessed with the beige. Obviously there were other colorway options, but this is such a classic. So I had to get it in white. I think that the Burberry pattern just pops quite nicely off the white and it's very clean. This is a size small tee for those of you wondering as far as, as, far as size reference goes. I did get a size small. It's a little bit more fitted than my medium tees that I usually get, but I'm quite happy with this sizing.
then for the last and a final pickup, I was able to actually snag, these tags are twisted here, but the most important part anyway is the pack of this. Uh, this is the Burberry denim jacket. So I just want to show you how dope and like really just well done the embroidery is on the back of this. So we've got the Supreme on the bottom here in navy with london england burberry with their logo on the top and this is just a really high quality embroidery uh embroidered work that was done on top of this denim jacket i think it just really is clean and really pops quite nicely on the back portion of this we do have the burberry supreme branding on the tag down below here in this brown leather which i think is really nice and just adds to the branding that you already see on the back here this is a size small for reference as well um, I will say as far as sizing goes this is very very small so this is more of a cropped fit I'm used to their denim coats actually or denim jackets being quite larger uh, a little bit more oversized but I will say that this was definitely a little bit more on the fitted size range uh, so let's go to the front of the jacket so no pops of detail embroidered wise like you see on the back but we do have the burberry logo that actually pops down below right there which is nice and subtle i do love that they kind of left the front of this kind of clean uh, but definitely this is something that is seasonless you can wear this all year round and we also have the burberry supreme buttons which pop quite nicely as well just a nice subtle detail there Again, this is more of a cropped fit. So if you were hoping that this was more of an oversized uh, jacket, definitely size up in this one because it does run quite small. This is definitely cropped on myself and the arms just barely fit. Uh, so definitely take that into consideration if you're looking at paying resale for this jacket. jump into sellout times see what flew off the shelves so the first item that sold quite fast which is one of the pieces i actually wanted it is the sherling collared down puffer jacket in that beige colorway and a double xl that went in five seconds uh next was the supreme burberry box logo hooded sweatshirt which i was unable to get this time around i did not get a sweatshirt even though i really really wanted one and that went in the heather gray in a size small in 5.8 seconds followed by the supreme burberry rugby which i did not actually go for any of the rugby pieces that did go in six seconds followed by the beige colorway option the rugby shirt in seven then the next option that flew off the shelves was the supreme burberry denim jacket in double xl which went in seven seconds then the burberry box logo tee in white in the double xl in 7.9 seconds followed by the box logo hooded sweatshirt in black in a size small in eight then again the denim jacket in wash blue in a size small went in eight seconds then the white small burberry box logo tee followed by the supreme burberry denim jacket in pink and double xl in eight seconds so there you have it it looks like people went pretty crazy obviously for the bogo hooded sweatshirts as well as some of the tees and it looks like this denim jacket really was one of the most sought after pieces followed by that puffer and some of those rugby pieces. All right, so now let's conclude with how some of these are doing currently on the resale market. So the denim jacket, which retailed at $2.98 is going between $9.50 to $1,200, which is insane. Uh, this was definitely obviously one of the most sought after pieces. I would say that the beige denim is doing just as well. The pink is not doing as well, but 
this is definitely a classic piece that I think that you can wear all year round and it's not really going to go out of style. Uh, next up, the deck, which retailed at $68, is going around $216. If you do want to buy the whole pack, it's going around $400. Definitely a great colorway that I think is doing the best though is the beige colorway option. For the t-shirt, this retailed at $54 and is going between $250 to $450, which is also a steep price uh, point for that resale pricing. All right, that's it for my Supreme lookbook. Thank you so much everyone for tuning in. If you're new here today, be sure to hit that subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up. If you have any comments or questions, feel free to leave those down below. Hit that notification bell because we do have a ton of heat coming out that I don't want you to miss out on. Also, be sure to check out that join button and our merch store. This is Shay TV. My name is Marissa Hill. We will catch you all in the next episode.